Mordremoth has to be stopped for good. Oh, well, we don't do that. All right, let's go. What the fuck? What the hell is? Am I supposed to go in there? My dude. My dude. Come. Fuck it. Be a, be a me. Oh. <laughs>back to another episode of proper play uh we are playing some guild wars today and you see that i'm playing with a different character today i do have a few characters not more than probably the average person playing guild wars but i do have a couple of maxed out level 80 characters this is one of them uh this is my necromancer his name is Arisiant von croy um i actually have fun with this character i don't really like the salvari too too much in this game but um i designed them in a way that was favorable to me so um yeah yeah this one here i really customized it to my liking this is my main weapons that i use which you can see i've actually got the uh, i think it's called the eye of romort i probably would be corrected on it i don't know what is going on behind me um, but yeah, you can see the, the freaky eye on my scepter is moving. Really cool stuff. Um, it's ascended as well as my dagger. And then when I switch the weapons, I have an axe. I do axe and I do a focus. Now, a lot of people who play Necromancer, they play with the um, staff. And I choose not to do that. I don't run with wells and all that. I'm a con I, I do deal a lot of condition damage. And I will not be changing my Necro to Reaper. At least until I figure out if it's something that's going to benefit me. And something that I enjoy playing. But right now, I like my builds the way that I do it. Just because it's fun to play. But today, we are going to be... Um, with this particular character, I want to mess around with the... Um, new story of the heart of thorns i have not touched it yet and i'm doing my uh season two with arisiant i mean not really arisiant, with sif and i wanted to try with arisiant to do the living story or the story mode for um heart of thorns so we're going to kick that off all right so looking at the story here um heart of thorns the prologue is the rally to maguma so we're going to start with that prepare for the next battle in the war against Mortimoth, which is kind of skipping from where I was on the living story. So it's going to be kind of me doing two stories at once with two different characters. So we are going to start with this one. So let's figure out where we need to go and let's get there. I'm not familiar with this, but this looks pretty awesome with the, that looks awesome. I've never either. I've never seen this. This is new or something. I just never really paid attention to, but that is awesome. It looks like the galaxies in there. That is awesome. But yeah, the weapon I have right now, you see the focus, um, which is uh, in my offhand. I love that. Um, it just looks cool. So that's why I made it. It's a, what I call a super exotic. And why do I keep missing my turn? I guess because I wanted to go in there. Um, but yeah, it's what I call a super exotic. The same thing as my, um, my staff. I mean, my scepter. Super exotic. So let's see where we're going here. Let's see if, if we can get there by foot. Ah, oh, he's a saboteur. He's trying to he's trying to blow me up. You're going to blow yourself up, bro. <laughs> That's valuable. That is valuable. Let's see. Kind of really don't want to waste my time doing this. I just wanted to have a little fun with it. Wow, this cat hit me with something. I'm going to have to repay him for that little move. Yeah, death. It's straight death. I don't really play around with this character. He's, pretty, he's probably my favorite to play with, but I don't play with this character too often just because for me, he, it almost in, in PvE, let me say. Even in, in World v. World, he's actually fun to play with, but um, in player versus environment, it's not really fun for the most part just because of the fact that it's, he he's, to me, is so OP, so overpowering to play with this guy. I mean, he he is very dominating. In regards to fighting others. Alright, the Silver Waste. Now, I honestly don't remember if I've ever been to this place. I've heard of it, but I don't know if I've actually been here. Well, one thing I've noticed is that this place is still busy. When I stopped playing the game about a year ago, the Silver Waste was pretty busy. There's a lot of events to do here, which honestly, after this, 
which is something that you'll probably see if you joined it. Um, I'm probably gonna gonna do this on my Twitch and try to kind of do some events. It looks like we're almost at the part, but damn, there's a what the fuck is that? All right, let's do our thing then. Shoot. All right, we're almost at the point, but let's finish this quest here. This dude don't look friendly at all. Uh -uh. All right, all right. Gold medal for the event. Woo woo. All right, that. What the fuck is this thing? Mordrum is still alive, but he's oh, that was a waste. All right, let's let's get some of these people up. So what are we supposed to do here? All right, seems like we got a little cut story here. Mordromoth proved even more powerful than we imagined. The jungle itself set against us and shredded our ships. And then there was the call. All of us Silvari heard it, and many followed Mordromoth's commands, turning on their packed allies. Many are dead. Still others are missing. And our fleet is utterly broken. If rescue doesn't come soon, there won't be anything left to rescue. Please, we need your help. Okay, this is why I'm playing Season 2, because I know I'm going to probably be missing a lot of stuff, because Season 2 happens right before this, and he said some are missing, and I saw air. There was a picture of air uh, on there when when he said that, so is she missing? What's going on? All right, who are we about to talk to up here? Technician. Commander Oak. on the field, Ten Hut. That's me, gangster. Good to see you, Commander. Some of your associates are already in the field. They were eager to help. At ease, tactician. Larenthea called for my assistance. What I got voice now? The situation what? Oh yeah, I did have voice We've before. We've seen a few survivors coming out of the jungle, and the news isn't good. Mordremoth destroyed the fleet as soon as it arrived. It was a massacre. Those that survived are in disarray. We're keeping the way out of Maguma open, mostly. But Amber Tall as shit. is getting hit pretty hard. If we lose that... We won't. We need that way out for survivors, and a way in for reinforcements if we're going to turn this around. We also need Traherne and Destiny's Edge. They were with the fleet, and I need to know what happened to them. Alright. So y'all don't have to hear my voice acting on this guy this time. Um, <laughs> obviously. Or at least for the most part. Um... But it seems like we got to escort reinforcements and clear Amber Sandfall to Mordrum to establish a pack rally point. So let's 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 get it done. I see a sh shield out there. Which way am I going? Looking pretty grim. We don't have the full story yet, but based on preliminary assessments, don't run me over. Prepare for the worst. Our orders haven't changed. Hold this fort at all costs. We lost the fleet, but we're not losing the Silver Wastes. Amber Sandfall is now the primary rally point for survivors. The Pact is relying on us to hold this ground. Look sharp and do your job. Mordremoth won the first round, but this war is far from over. Word. So let's go, man. Oh, this damn talking. I'm ready to go. 
I see where I'm supposed to go on my map. So let's ride. Oh yeah, it's battle time, baby. Y'all ain't ready. Y'all ain't ready. Hmm. They all about to die, and I'm only fighting one dude. See, that's what I mean. Dude is not fair. This dude is not fair to even play with, but hey, it is what it is. Oh, here's Brom. What up, Brom? What up, Rox? And your little, uh, whatever that is. What are we doing over here? Oh, we talking to him. Glad you're here. Back up. You kind of in my Mark face. Wiped out the entire fleet. The news has frostbite Dude, if you anxious. press the button on I my control. Edge was on board. Talking to the cat, by the way. He's sitting on my lap, my little kitten. And he Who's keeps messing with my cord on my headset. I didn't go so wrong this time. <laughs> We're about to see for ourselves. I need you to at the staging area near Amber Sandfall and ready to go when I arrive. We'll be there. Just gotta mop up the last of these mortem. Sounds good. See you soon. Alright, cool. Let's roll. We got some more over here. There's a damn war going on over here, man. Like, for real. I gotta watch these uh, enemies here, man. Oh, shit. We got some hyenas? Watch out. Alright, here we go. I see some enemies right here. We first to deal with like this. Uh. Mm. Oh yeah, they don't like me because they don't. Conditions is their weakness. Uh uh. Uh uh. Yeah. See, they don't like me. There's a hyena over here. This must have been the one that was following me. No, sir. Come on. Come on. All right. All right. What's going on? Thank the gods you're here, boss. We were hoping for some sign of Kate and the aid. But we found this. We did verify that Kate has been through here in the last day or so. Sorry we can't give you more. We'll get the egg back, but right now our top priority is Mordremoth. What's the situation here? Mordrem attacked after you left for Camp Resolve. We went to help Amber Sandfall. Bram and Rox went to Red Rock. I never made it to Camp Resolve. Once I heard the fleet had been attacked, I knew I'd be needed here. So it's even worse than it looks. You can count on us, boss. We're ready to go. Just say the word. Word. Consider it said. Finish up what you're doing on the edge of the jungle. We'll all go in together. Good. First my sister, then the Zephrite Masters, now the Pact Fleet. Mordremoth has to be stopped for good. Oh, we gonna do that. Alright, let's go. What the fuck? What the hell is... Am I supposed to go in there? My dude. My dude. Come. Oh, fuck it. Yeah. I know once I get in there. Oh, I'm dodging way early. Alright. Dude, we're supposed to be hitting this dude. No. Ah, I let him smack me. That's unheard of. Alright, let's see if I can knock out this vine crawler here. Oh, we going Oh shit. Now we rolling with the axe. This is why I do the axe here. It's for my axe and my focus is for one-on-one -on -one battles. I, because it does the most damage and drops the conditions at the same time, the needed conditions. I fucking with the wrong one. Almost gone. Done. All right. Now y'all. Now y'all. Y'all fucked up. Now. Hit this dude. I want this dude. No, I want this dude. Hit him. I need to zoom out. Shit. I can't see shit. Oh. Back. Damn it. Fucking wolf. Nope. Oh. 
We know. We got you. There we go. Alright. So we're heading up in here. I see somebody dead up there. Let's go. Dude, this dude is huge. Ooh, damn, who is this? Alright. That's a player over there. He just shot. I didn't know I was in the same map as other people. That's pretty cool. Is he down? I got you, bro. I got you. I got you. Get him up. 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 Ah. All right. Shroud. All right. Alright, we got him, man. We got him. Whoa, what the fuck? No, we got to go, man. <laughs> we got to get out of here. I'm not fucking with that thing again. Alright, let's get in here. They seem to need help. Uh, uh. For real war going on in here. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, what? Let's go. Let's go. Let's drop the nasties on them. Huh. Watch out. Okay. Alright. So we got the fence. We got the fence going on in here. Take this dude out. Are we in here? Oh shit! What the fuck does he got chasing me? Huh? Nope. All right, we got that out of the way. All right, what we we need to rebuild these doors. What the fuck is going on up here? All right. Is he a chimp? No, he's not a champ. What? What? Oh. Uh huh. Uh-uh. Damn, he hit me with a nasty. All right, we got you. Uh-uh. All right. Damn, I missed the dog. All right, what else we got? We good? Let's see if we can repair this door, can we? Nope. All right, wait a minute. Where is the, uh... What the fuck? Is she up there? There's supposed to be somebody here. Where is she at? Right here. Dead. <laughs> Come on, I got you. Oh, hell no. I see you. I just saw you. There we go. Oh, knocked me off the damn thing. All right. That should have ate those conditions. What the fuck? Uh-uh. All right. So we good there. Let's go. Get her up. Hmm. For real? We got more? Oh, shit. These fucking wolves, dude. Ah, uh, come on, dude, get up. All right, I got you, I got you, I got you. Get up. We got you, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, we're good. Damn. Go, get out of there, get out of there. Using my life force to get the fuck up this hill. Don't fall. All right. And out. All right, now get her up. Is she up? Thank you. Alright, now, I don't know how I've survived, honestly, by a freaking miracle. Let's get these guys out of here.
The amazing part is that this is part of my freaking quest. Alright. Let's move down. Let's go. Let's go. Alright. Oh, fuck. For real? Let's go. Oh. Get him. Get him. Let's go ahead and drop that on him. And that. All right, let's see. Ain't nothing wrong with a little reaping. All right, we good? What the fuck? I hate these bastards, man. These fuckers are ruthless. Oh, he got me. Watch out. No. <laughs> Come on. Back out of it. Let's heal. <clears throat> what the fuck? Okay. What are we... Oh, hell. Oh, man. This shit is real, son. What the hell... Alright. What else we got? We're just defending, right? Alright, cool. 13 seconds. We got this. That's done. There we go. Got him. Enter the pack staging area. That's over here. I see it. Let's go. What's the deal? Hey, boss! Radasoom was all a buzz over the Pack Fleet disaster. I knew you'd get involved, so I came to pitch in. Scruffy and I gave these locals a lesson in Mordrum bashing while we waited for you. Oh, and Kanak helped too. Yes, I helped. And I thought the firstborn would follow themselves. Commander, Countess Anise sent me to support you and represent the Shining Blade in the fight against Mortar. I don't know if you a thug, but your face look like a thug. I doubt. Where'd you get that uh, pauldron from? That pauldron is for freaking sweet. As far away as Diesa Plateau. I also have an obvious personal stake in defeating the Jungle Dragon. In any case, I am at your disposal. Glad to have you both aboard. We're going to need all the help we can get. Let's move out. Alright. Where are we going? Looks like it's up here, right? Dude, what the hell? What the fuck? Oh shit! Get Wars Two Heart of Thorns. That's the little intro for the expansion. That's what's up. And we finished the mission, so pretty cool. Um, I didn't. I wanted to leave it real short. I didn't want to do too much prologue to the rally. Prologue. The rally to Maguma completed. Pack crowbar. Okay. So um, I wanted to get that done, which is pretty cool. Um, so we got a next part coming up. I'm going to save that for next time. I, th I think we did a little bit, you know, did a little bit for this episode here. I just want to make something a little short. Probably going to get on Twitch after this. So, but obviously before I put this gameplay up, you would have seen that if you were on Twitch. But I'll have the, uh, I'll probably post some highlights of what happened there. I want to do some. We're going to go ahead and end it right here on this one. I will finish up with that particular, uh, 
<sighs> with this here, I don't know. This, this was fun. Um, just to kind of get it started, I will probably continue. So I'll try to pop a, a Guild Wars, either the Season 2 or the Heart uh, Heart of Thorns an episode. I'll have Arisian here doing the Heart of Thorns. I'll have Sif doing the uh, Season 2. So I can kind of kill two birds with one stone because I really wanted to get to this storyline uh, and get into the expansion stuff. So um, if you like this video, definitely give it a thumbs up. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I do my Guild Wars thing. I do uh, The Sims, which I do need to pop another video of The Sims. And I, uh, my specialty, though, well, I wouldn't say my specialty, but uh, is retro games. I do arcade games. I do Super Nintendo. I haven't done any Sega yet, but that is coming. Um, different console games. So let me know if there's something you want to see me play in the description, all right? So, hey, thank you all for watching. And as I always say, pinky up. Look, he looked up there. He looked up when I said that. So pinky up, proper, out.